What is up, everyone? My name is Cody, and uh, I've got my first video in about a week. I'm sorry about that. Um, all my subscribers, I apologize. Um, but I just haven't had any motivation to make any videos. Um, I'm not sure why. Just got my license. I've been out more. Um, so, yeah, I apologize for that. I got my account back, and I made one video telling that I'd be making a lot more videos than I haven't. So I apologize for that. Uh, but anyways, I'm going to get on to it. Uh, this is going to be a tutorial on ITV settings, like uh, pretty much everything that you need to set your ITV to. Um, they're all pretty much, um, what is it? They're all pretty easy, I think. And like, it's kind of obvious what they'd be. But I'm getting a lot of comments asking for people to, you know, uh, asking for settings and stuff. And um, I can't hook it up because I do not uh, have an Xbox right now. Um, but, yeah, and my PS3 is not hooked up to it. So, um, I'll just run through these uh, settings. I have, okay, just, um, I'll go through these quickly. Uh, most of these you don't need to worry about because you can run ITV on your iPod and your iPhone and stuff like that. Uh, but I don't, I don't do that. It's probably something cool that you can do. Uh, but, you know, I don't find any use to it. So I'll just go through all this. Um, one thing that I really do suggest is before you're uh, planning on recording something big, um, or anything like that, I suggest recording it on an external hard drive. So you go right here, um, click your external hard drive or uh, whatever you're, you're using, or uh, maybe make a new folder, you know, saying like COD4 clips and like, you choose it. And uh, But mine just save right to my documents and then I can find them later from there. Um, so you can go ahead and change any of this, but I don't, I don't change it. Um, this, I, I don't touch that ever. Don't do that. Uh, right here, we're going to want to go to overscan and then uh, normal. Uh, when you're doing normal, one thing that you really want to do is have your TV and your computer, not your computer, your Xbox or PS3 on widescreen. If you don't, it will actually look like this. Um, but if you don't have widescreen or somehow you can't use widescreen, which I don't, I don't think that's possible, uh, you'd go ahead and click stretch. But it will look bad. I, I'm going to tell you that right now. Uh, progress, progress, blah, 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 progressive scan. Um, you need a fast Mac to do progressive scan, but uh, it's obviously going to help out big time with your quality there. Um, <clears throat> we're going to want to use a drop field. We're going to go over to full screen. Um, there, I don't use any of this. All it does is uh, you click start in full screen, and then your preview screen will be f completely full. Um, I usually minimize my any mine anyways because I usually end up watching, trying to watch both screens and stuff like that. Um, but I don't. I don't really touch any of these because I don't use use it for ITV like I said. Um, oh, here is probably the main thing that you guys need. Um, you need to go down here. This is probably what people. I'm getting a bunch of comments saying um, that people aren't, you know, their PVRs and picking up. You need to go over here, go to H or go to Hopog, and then it'll come up with all this stuff that you have. You want to click HD PVR. Uh, we're gonna go to custom. We'll see what I have down for custom. I haven't edited this in a while. Uh, there we go, 10 uh, megabits per second, or megabytes per second, I don't know how to say that. Uh, variable bit rate, standard on AAC. I'm going to go click OK. And uh, these are what your recording things are. I guess we'll go over to picture. I, I left everything right in the middle. So that's pretty much it. And I'm the only user on my, uh, on my computer, so I don't really have to worry about parents or anything. Uh, so yeah. That is pretty much it on this. I'm sorry if I you couldn't follow along by just listening to my voice. I've made a tutorial in a while. I'm a little bit rusty. Um, but I'll try to get some tutorials out and uh, maybe some more real-life videos and stuff like that um, out to you guys pretty soon. Um, but it, any of you guys that saw that video, Cody FX, thank you guys for coming over. Um, it is 100% legit. I'm. It kind of pains me that you guys don't think that I, I'm legit and uh, I'm acting like I got hacked or something. Um, I know people do that, but that's not me. Um, so yeah, thank you guys for uh, coming back to this channel. And uh, if you guys, uh, if this helps you out, please go ahead and uh, leave a like. And uh, if you look down my videos, you can find other HPVR tutorials, ITV tutorials, other things with recording uh, with a Mac. So uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will uh, see you guys next time. See you later.